Look what's just arrived from Hamburg, Germany. It's Pack and Smooch's case for the iPad Pro. It is I, Felix. Hello. So, I've ordered this case from Pack and Smooch. It's their 11 inch, the iPad Pro 11 inch Angus case in their light brown color. And these are the things that I've noticed about it so far. It's got very nice zippers that open up here. They're sort of silver metal metallic bit zippers with this soft touch leather tags. There's one on the front compartment as well. And those textures, those little interactions with this case feel really, really nice. This case, when you first see it, has professional feel, but it still feels handmade. Uh, that doesn't mean the stitching looks bad, but it means you can feel that it wasn't mass produced or anywhere. The next thing you find on the inside is not your usual sort of fluffy, uh, fluffy soft toy material you might find on a cheaper case, but this is a merino wool, kind of stiff texture. And when I ordered this, I wasn't sure if it would hold the iPad Pro with the magic keyboard as we've got the extended metal hinge. Additionally, I'm using the cover body system as well, which gives it a little extra bit of plastic. But happily, this slides in without any issue. Um, and when you zip it up, the zips go just over the top of them, the, the, the plastic edge of the cover body. So I can also demonstrate this without the cover body on. So here we go. This is it sliding in just as Apple would have intended it. You can see that when you zip it up, the zips go over the Apple Pencil with no issue whatsoever. There is a little place for the Apple Pencil to be stored if you don't want it actually magnetically attached to the iPad. And there's a nice leather card holder or a property of card holder. These are the nice little attentions to detail that Pack and Smooch have put into this case. It's also vegetable tanned leather and 100% handmade in Germany. I think what they've done here is create a really nice product that you actually want to pick up and hold. One other little point that I didn't mention, the front cover, the front pocket, uh, it's raw on the inside. So you see the, 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 the actual original back of the leather and then it's just the other side of the merino wool inner. That cover, that central pocket could easily take a USB adapter of some sort or a pair of headphones. At a pinch, I think you could get the UK adapter in there, but I really don't like that. Personally, I think, no, it's for cables and very flat items only. Just a little word on how Pack and Smooch send this. It comes in zero plastic packaging. They give you this little organic cotton. It's very right on, very trendy, uh, but I think it's really nice. Just a simple white. Cheap, cheap to make, I imagine, but not plastic bag that you can then probably use for something else. And it's shipped very fast using their expedited shipping, but they also offer standard price global shipping, which is tracked and goes via normal postal services. This whole package, I feel is basically, yes, you could get something cheaper, but there's a delight you get from picking up something that has this quality leather and this attention to detail and the design is is excellent and simplistic but functional one last point you may have noticed the zip is asymmetrical so one side is a wider opening which i think is nice because when you open it you're not fishing around trying to find the uh, the ipad it just comes out very neat no fuss no bother and the protection is on point that is the quick look at the Angus case from Pack and Smooch. I recommend it. I bought it myself and I wanted to just show you. Cheers.